Village. I'm here at Nokia World 2011 at the company's feature booth and we're taking a look at the new Kinetic device. So there is no touch screen here, this is basically just a prototype device to show one of the future interactions that Nokia thinks we, we might be using. And all you actually do here is twist the device to control it. So the volume control is right here, uh, we're playing a music track. So if I just twist it like so, I'm turning it down. If I twist it like so, I'm turning it up. I should be, yes. Um, then if I push it away, I come out of the mu to the music menu. And then uh, push back in, push away. Uh, how do I scroll up? I twist it like so. So we go music, photos. That's all we've got here, really. Music and photos. That's all we've got. Yeah. So this is how you zoom into the pictures, zoom out. It's quite, it's quite natural. So in order to bring the picture towards yourself, you kind of talk it like so, push it away like so, um, and again you you twist the corners to scroll between the photos. And it only really requires very gentle touch. It doesn't require you to yes. do too much. Does this actually have a future? Do you expect to be able to integrate it into any phones in the future? If people like it, it's worth continuing. And what sort of a display is this? This looks to be about a 3.7 to 4 inch display. So is it AMOLED? Yes, it's flexible. Flexible AMOLED display. Made of plastic. Yeah. Made out of plastic. Yeah. Alright. 